Earthbed. Good day learners, this is Earth Pen. In this another video, we will understand this time a very common kitchen occurrence. It is very common and popular to the point we neglect the signs behind it. And let's learn why do we cry when chopping onions. But before we begin the discussion, if you would like to encourage us to produce more educational content, Please show your support by giving a like to the video and subscribing to our channel. You can also help our team grow with your monetary support through our donation PayPal link located in the description below. Did you know that the oldest onion cultivation known was way back around 5000 BCE? This means that onions are lingering our kitchens for 7,000 years already. Yet up until now. Onions are one of the must-have kitchen ingredients because it accentuates every dish. It's in our burgers, pizzas, and almost every meat dish. It is used as either a vegetable or a spice because it could also provide aromatic touch. But on the side note, chopping this precious vegetable aren't easy because it will definitely make us cry. And we will find out why in a few minutes. Because let us understand first the reason why we humans cry. We are all very capable of tearing up liquids from our eyes mainly because of three reasons. The first reason is because of emotional feelings. This is what we call emotional tears that occur when we feel too much emotions like happiness, pain, stress, and others. But this is not the type of tears we produce when chopping onions, unless you are already very emotional when doing it. Some would claim that they are not able to cry, but that is not true. This is because of the basal tears. The second type of tear that is produced to protect our eyes from drying out. This type is also called the protective tears because it lubricates our eyeballs and protects it from the natural irritations. This is newly produced every time we blink our eyelids. That is why not blinking for a long time might dry our eyes. But just like emotional tears, basal tears doesn't have anything to do with why we tear up when cutting on. That lead us to our last type of tears which is reflexive tears. This type of tears is produced by our reflexes, mainly to protect our eyes against foreign bodies and chemical irritants. And yes, this is the tears we produce when we chop our onions. How could it be a foreign body or a chemical irritant to our eyes when we aren't even touching our eyes? Listen carefully. Onions are not the main culprit why we produce reflexive tears when we are cutting it. This is because of a chemical compound released when onion cells are chopped into pieces. This is an evolved mechanism of onion plants to protect itself from microorganism consumers. The instance we cut the onion, it produces a lacrimatory factor sentence into the air. Now that it exposed in the air, the sentase enzyme converts the amino acid sulfosides of the onion into sulfinic acid. This sulfinic acid are very unstable that it must rearrange itself into syn propanethyl S oxide. The syn propanethyl S oxide will blend in the air and it irritates the lacrimal glands in our eyes. When it comes in contact, producing a reflexive deep now, initially, the best thing to do to prevent the irritation is to close our eyes. 
But that isn't the wisest decision that we should do, especially while we are chopping. That is the reason why your brain decides to produce excessive reflexive tears to remove the irritating substance in our eyes at the same time, renews the protective liquid layer. So what should we really do to prevent tearing up while chopping onions? The most efficient way to prevent tearing up while chopping onions is wearing an airtight goggles for your eyes so that the air with irritants would not be able to come in contact with your eyes. Some would also say that cooling or chilling the onions will help. This is because lowering the temperature slows down the chemical reaction of the enzymes. And that is all for now. I hope you learned something from us today. Once again, this is Earth Pen. Learning has never been this easy for anyone, anywhere.